All right, time to go all Dave and Attenborough on the Fallout 4 Far Harbor trailer. We're going to go through all the new wildlife, all the exciting secrets of nature. Yes, and here we have some dead wildlife. Yeah. Nice, uh, friendly... A corpse, a skeleton, it's a ghoul whale. Dun, dun, dun. But, you know, we don't know if it's a ghoul whale. Could just be a normal whale. Will we see these enemies? Will we see these enemies, though? I don't know. Because there is, like, uh, the diver scuba kind of gear that we see in it. And also that discussion between two settlers that's there now that you can see that talks about a ghoul whale. But, yeah. So, uh... Yeah, it's a whale. Not much new This here. is a fishing town, and there's whales that are dead. So let's get into the actual live creatures. This big motherfucker, we've got this big Lobster mutated thing? shrimp. Yeah, I, I'm going to say, people have been saying praying mantis and stuff, but I say, like, look at its, like, shrimp. Look at its, yeah. like, tail. Like, shrimp lobstery type thing. Look at the, um, like, a little antenna coming out the front. Yeah. And it's going through the water, I mean. And, and this is also a fishing town, and there was a sign with a shrimp saying, welcome to Far Harbor, or a lobster, or whatever it was. You know what I mean? Crustacean it's some sort of thing. crustacean, yeah. But, um, and, like, we see this in a later shot, um, and we're mm. fighting it up front. And that's where it looks a bit more buggy, and it's got these big clawy things. But, you know, shrimp have those sort of Oh, yeah, dude. It looks things. very shrimpy to me. Very prawny. Yeah, so we've got this shrimp prawn mutant thing. So, uh, I don't know what else to say about that. It's just going to look gnarly. And we're going to shoot it with the harpoon gun. We're going fishing. Um, but, uh, yeah, so there's also, in the theme of fishing, we've got this feral ghoul that's got, like, a net over yeah. it. And it's. I think this is just a new type of feral ghoul. It'll probably be, like, feral ghoul drowned or some shit or drowned feral ghoul or some shit yeah. and we'll just have like you know nets and stuff it's on not it. the most exciting thing but it's definitely worth pointing out and now this is one that we actually see in the later part of yeah the and this i mean at first it's sort of like its stance was like a death claw obviously it's not a death claw it sort of looks like an axolotl salamander kind of like yeah yeah thing. i'd be willing to say that do you know what it reminds axolotl. you of i like saying that <laughs> do you know what happened when, when i first saw the trailer Straight away, I thought of Guaz from Morrowind. Right. Like those little hunched over <laughs> round face yeah, things. Yeah, like that's yeah. what it kind of looks like. And there's one off in the distance there as well under the tree. Mm. Um, but yeah, I, I guess Salamander and Axolotl is a good guess. But another kind of new um, enemy. Mutated it's creature. near water and stuff as well. But uh, actually, we'd have to look up. Or you guys can tell us in the comments. Do you get Salamanders and Axolotls and stuff? <laughs> around that area mm. uh, geographically. But there is also the best in the whole trailer. We've got this angler fish, this little man in disguise. I love it. At first, I was fooled. Not that it wasn't there, that it actually had two lights on its head. <laughs> yeah, like that, that's it. <laughs> it's nice environmental detail too. Like, So there's all these little glowing light thing, lily pads. You'll be walking along through the rivers or creeks or whatnot, and then bang, one jumps out at you and... Um, you know what I can already see people doing? It's just, what's up? What is, um... <laughs> what I can pe see people doing is using vats. Like, they yeah, just walk yeah. through the water and they're going... To detect one. But it's definitely... its face. I love it. So, I don't even know, like... It's so cute. Technically, what it is, like, an anglerfish. I don't know if they get anglerfish. No, because that's, like, a super deep sea creature. But anyway, it's probably some sort of mutant thing. I don't know. Radiation, it's an excuse for everything. You can just make anything look like however you want. <laughs> yeah. But uh, it's interesting. Another interesting enemy. Like, there's lots Very of cool how it's actually not just a fish, though. Like, yeah. If you think of, like, an, an anglerfish or whatever, like, it does not jump out of the water with big, muscly arms. <laughs> and when you look at it jump at you, and it's big like teeth. Like a big frog. And... But, uh, yeah, it looks interesting. And hopefully there's different types as well. Like, that's what I wanted to see as well. Like, you know, there might be this one, which is like the standard one, which is like gold skin. But then there's sort of like... Imagine a stealth one. Yeah, well, like, I mean, like, like, look at the variation they have with different creatures in the game already. Like, if you look at, say, Death Claws, you have your um, chameleon Death Claws like, and, and your um, glowing... Like, imagine a glowing one of whatever this is. Yeah, yeah. Glowing Angler. Glowing... Axolotl oh, that's gonna be mad thing. to see. Actually, maybe this one is. It, glowing. Yeah, actually, it probably is. That prawn. That probably we, is. So, a if glowing we, prawn. Yeah. So, um, yeah, yum. Glowing prawns for lunch. Hungry. But uh, so overall, there's the big shrimp prawn thing, which we'll put our money on and say it's. <laughs> I love the way we're describing this. It's like, all right, guys, we've got a big shrimp. Hey, actually, an axolotl. I wonder what it would be called. Like, it'd be funny if they just call them prawns. Yeah. I want to see the enemy called a prawn. But um, we can console command that in. There's uh, 
Yeah, so there's the prawns, the axolotl, salamandery, deathclaw moving kind of things. Hey, I wonder with the Wasteland Workshop DLC if they'll extend upon that so you can trap these kind of creatures. Oh, that would be awesome. How fun would it be because to have a mini underwater, half on land, half in the water trap for that angler looking thing? You know what I mean? Yeah, Just yeah. like little like... Because... Unleash the prawns. I wonder, I wonder how many settlements they'll add. Do you know what the trap will be? It'll just be a net. <laughs> it be a big fishing net. Yeah, I wonder how many settlements they will add. Like, Because people are speculating that one. the one at the start is customizable. The one with the actual like settled dudes I'm in I'm going to say at least one. They're not going to yeah. have no customizable settlements. But yeah. So that's about it. There's the gold angler fish mutant thing. There is the prawn shrimp lobster <laughs> thing. There is the axolotl salamander type thing. And there's and, a ghoul wearing a nest. Yeah. And there's also like whale bones, but we don't know whether that means they're actually going to be in the game or just sort of part of the scenery and like story and the whatnot. folklore kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah, we'll find out soon. Thanks for watching, guys. Follow us on Snapchat and subscribe because we are doing heaps of Far Harbor content.